that I'm recording. What? What? You guys see him trying to play with me? What cookie? <laughs> what do you want? Oh my god, Zoe, what are you doing? Stop, you're gonna drop my coffee. So, good morning. <laughs> oh my god, they're not gonna let me record. You guys never do. Good morning. Um, it is Monday. Monday, uh, <laughs> ugh, it's horrible. <sighs> Being in front of the camera is hard, you guys. Like, it's hard. I just won my first pro fight. <laughs> um, so I just thought I'll, you know, upload a video and kind of tell you guys what it is that happened throughout the week of the fight because it was it was pretty freaking stressful, and um. Yeah, just pretty much tell you guys what what it is, how everything went down. Uh, and just let's put you guys in the scoop. So, you guys take a seat. I got my cup of coffee with me with tons of foam. Get your cup of coffee or tea or glass of wine, whatever it is that you guys do in the morning, night, afternoon, whatever, whenever you watch this. And get some popcorn because I got a story to tell you guys. But leading up to the fight... I, I I wasn't able to sleep for a while. I don't know why. My body was just so tired. And I'm sure a lot of fighters get this where your body's tired and you're trying to sleep and you can't. Like my mind was running a thousand miles per hour. And then I would fall. And then when I would fall asleep, I wake back up because my body was hurting, like aching so much. Um, I was I was really pushing my. And the week before the fight, I ordered uh, my fight clothes from Under Armour. Underarmour.com. You guys freaking suck, by the way. I before I get ahead of myself. I ordered my fight clothes and I'm like, okay, I'm cool. I'm gonna put two day delivery, which is freaking expensive. Like a girl does not got money like that. And cookie. Like a girl does not got money like that. And Monday comes along Tuesday. And I'm like, okay, you know what? It'll be here by Wednesday for sure. Sure enough, Wednesday didn't show up. Thursday night, it didn't show up. Friday night, I started really stressing out because I'm like, okay, weigh-ins today, fight tomorrow. Like, why is my shit not here yet? So, finally, Saturday uh, Saturday morning, I gave up. I'm like, you know what? I need to go find my clothes or go buy something because it's just, I can't not wait until, like, hours before my fight, which it really was hours, but I mean, like, I couldn't wait two hours before my fight or anything. So, I woke up Saturday morning early as hell. I want to go have brunch with my family. And then I went um, to the Nike store because my freaking package never arrived. My sport bra, my shorts, nothing came in. I had a hoodie so I could walk out in. It's just, I was like, Under Armour, you guys fucked me bad. And I'm so upset about that. My shit still hasn't got here. It's Monday now. So I ordered, I ordered my clothes Saturday. September 28th, it is now November 6th, and my clothes are still not got here. And I paid, like, and the money's out of my account. So, I don't know, at this point, I don't know what to do. My stuff still hasn't got here, which I'm probably going to, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm planning on returning it, because I'm, I'm not wearing Under Armour. They suck. You guys freaking suck bad. So, that happened. So, then, we fight, and... A lot of people were like, oh, you got this, you got this. But honestly, like, all the emotions that were running through my head were like, girl, you've been through too much. Like, this is nothing, you know? And the reason I say I've been through too much is because, like, more of my personal life. And if you guys want me to get into more details with that, I'll make another video. But this is just strictly for the fight. And I don't know. I Walking out, I was, like, hearing the crowd cheer the way I felt before even walking out to the fight like I was standing there and my, my song came out and I just felt everybody's energy like it was insane and I'm not picking my nose you guys I don't know why I have the tendency to do that I'm sorry <laughs> but anyways um, 
I felt the crowd's energy and I like stepped back because I haven't felt, I haven't fought in my hometown since like 2014. So feeling everybody's love and support was really awesome. Um, I got like overwhelmed. I was like, my heart started pounding. Um, you know, it's, it, it's, 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 an, it's a beautiful feeling having all those people cheer for you that people that love you and care about you. And like the whole crowd was just cheering. Oh, it was so it was awesome and then fighting and like I just zoned out I blanked everybody out it was just me and that girl in the cage and there's I'm very critical about myself so my performance I'm I mean thank God I won I'm happy I won but I really wish I did other things different uh, the way I felt after I won was amazing I uh I was like Words can't even describe the feeling. Feeling everybody's energy, feeling winning, seeing my family, because they were up in the higher level. They were all bouncing and cheering for me. I mean, even right now, it makes me want to tear up. I'm, uh, it, it was, it's a beautiful feeling, you know? So with that being said, after the fight, I went out, I hugged everybody, I kissed everybody. I mean, obviously, like I kissed them in the cheek. Um, I just really want to thank everybody for going out to the fights Saturday night and just supporting Fight Ready and the team and honestly like you guys are the best uh it's it's been it's more than you know just people that I know it's people that really genuinely care about me and I couldn't be more grateful for all of you guys thank you so much I want to thank my sponsors on communications uh top mount apparel thank you guys for believing in me I want to thank my management uh sucker punch Thank you guys for being awesome people to work with. Thank you so much. I really want to thank Benny for helping me out through all of this. You know, Fight Camp isn't easy. Just everything that has that gets put into Fight Camp. Thank you so much, Benny. Uh, and just you guys all so much for everything. I couldn't, I couldn't be more gra grateful for you guys. You guys are awesome. Um, as of right now, I I got asked a few times on social media, what's next? So. I still don't know what's next. I have to ask my coaches. We have to sit down and really discuss what we're planning to do. Uh, if we wait for 2018 or if we try to get one more in, it would be tight, but I don't know yet. We'll see. Um, this win, I'm enjoying it, but I know there's so many more to come. They're only going to get harder and I have to keep training harder. So with that being said, I'm enjoying this win, but I just know this is a stepping stone to something better. It's just going to get harder and harder, and I'm, you know, I'm mentally preparing myself for that, and uh, you guys are going to watch me grow, you know, you guys are going to watch me grow as a person, as an athlete, uh, you know, I'm putting myself out there, being in front of the camera, being on social media, I'm a private person, so I'm putting myself out there, it's, it's, it's something very vulnerable, and you got to be very strong-minded and uh, emotionally stable for something like that. And I think I'm ready, you know? I am ready. I've been I've been vlogging, actually, for a long time. But I can't post it just because my editing skills is not the best. So, <laughs> I have so much videos just saved that I've edited on my laptop. And I just refuse to put them up just because the quality is horrible. But if you guys want to see them, let me know. I will post them up. If you guys want me to keep posting these kind of videos where I just sit down and chit chat with you guys, let me know. Thank you guys so much for following me. Thank you guys so much for supporting me. And thank you so much for being interested in my career. And just, you know, giving out that beautiful um, energy because I do feel it um, constantly. So thank you. I love you guys so much. And see you in the next video. Bye.